Hello, you are welcome to solve this math problem, which is x squared minus x power 3 is equal to 150. To find the values of x from this equation. Now, in the first step, we'll take this 150 to the left side. So, it will be this, which is x squared minus x power 3. This will take to this side to be minus 150 is equal to 0. Then, in the next step, we'll split this minus 150 according to this corresponding exponents. So, it will be x square minus x power 3. Then, minus 150 is same as minus 25 minus 125, which is equal to 0. Then, in the next step, it will be x square minus x power 3, then minus 25 will place into exponent. So it will be minus 25, it is 5 square, then minus 125, it is 5 power 3 is equal to 0. Then in the next step, it will be x square, we place with square together. So x square, then this minus 5 square. Then this minus x power 3, then this minus 5 power 3 is equal to 0. Then we place in, in, in the bracket. So here inside the bracket, so it will be x square minus 5 square bracket. And here we take negative outside of bracket. So take negative here outside of bracket. Negative x power 3 divided by negative is positive x power 3. Negative 5 power 3 divided by negative is positive 5 power 3. Bracket is equal to 0. Then in the next step, from this part here inside the bracket is in the form of a perfect square. So we'll apply perfect square rule, which is a square minus b square is equal to a plus b bracket bracket a minus b bracket. So from this rule here, we'll apply this form of a plus b, it will be x plus 5. So here, x plus 5 bracket, bracket, a minus b, it will be x minus 5. So here, x minus 5 bracket, then this here, minus, from this part here inside the bracket here, is in the form of a perfect cube. So we'll apply a perfect cube rule in this form, whereas this is in the form of a power 3 plus b power 3, which is equal to a plus b bracket bracket a square minus a b plus b square bracket. So we'll apply from this rule, we'll apply this form here of a plus b, it will be x plus 5. So here bracket x plus 5 bracket bracket a square, it will be x square. Then minus ab, it will be minus x times 5 is 5x. Then plus b square, it will be 5 square, which is 25 bracket, is equal to 0. Then in the next step, from here in the left side, x plus 5 is common. So we'll take x plus 5 bracket out of bracket, this divided by this, it is this x minus 5. You can place inside the bracket, then minus here. This divided by this, it is this quadratic expression here, this here. So it will be bracket x square minus 5x plus 25 bracket bracket is equal to 0. Then it will be x plus 5 bracket bracket. Here we we'll open the bracket. So here we'll open the here to be x minus 5. We we'll open this bracket by this negative. So it will be minus x square. Here we we'll open here to be plus 5x. We we'll open by negative to be minus 25 bracket is equal to 0. Then in the next step, it will be x plus 5 bracket, then bracket. 
we'll start by this square so it will start by this negative x square then x plus 5x to be plus 6x minus 5 minus 25 is minus 30 bracket is equal to 0 then in the next step it will be from here we have two solutions so this is first solution which is x plus 5 is equal to 0 and this second solution which is minus x square plus 6x minus 30 is equal to 0 now from this first solution we we'll take 5 to this side so it will be x is equal to negative 5 so this is the first value of x which is real solution <clears throat> and so from this quadratic equation we'll make this minus x square positive so we'll divide or we'll multiply the whole equation we'll multiply the whole equation times negative 1 so negative x square times negative 1 is positive x square 6x times negative 1 is negative 6x negative 30 times negative 1 is positive 30 is equal to 0 times negative 1 it is 0 then from this quadratic equation we solve by using quadratic formula so to find the values of x to be x is equal to negative b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac over 2a so it will be x is equal to negative b b is negative 6 so it will be here bracket negative 6 bracket plus or minus square root of b square it will be negative 6 bracket square then minus 4 times a a it is 1 times c c is 30 so here times 30 then over 2 times a a is 1 then it will be x is equal to negative and negative 6 to be positive 6 plus or minus square root of negative 6 square is positive 36 negative 4 times 30 is negative 120 then over this and this is 2 then from here it will be x is equal to 6 plus or minus so 6 plus or minus square root of 36 minus 120 here we borrow it to be 10 minus 6 10 minus 6 here it will be 4 here it will be 11 11 minus 3 it will be 8 so it will be negative 84 then over 2 so it will be x is equal to 6 plus or minus square root of negative 84 is same as square root of 84 it is 21 times 4 then times this negative so here to be times negative 1 then over this 2 so it will be x is equal to 6 plus or minus square root of this 4 here it is 2 then times this square root of 21 square root of negative 1 it is i so here it will be times i then we divide by 2 in this part and in this part so it will be x is equal to 6 divided by 2 it is 3 plus or minus this 2 will cancel this 2 so it will be plus or minus square root of 21 times i so 21 i so from here also we have two solutions which are complex solutions Therefore, our conclusion, the first value of x, the first value of x is this negative 5, and here the second and the third value of x is 2 plus square root of 21i and 2 minus square root of 21i. Thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps to miss out. Subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video. Bye-bye.